It's a crime that happens all the time. Trailers taken from homes and businesses anywhere they're left sitting. 7 News reporter Laura Thomas explains what you need to know to keep from becoming a victim. Trailer thefts are reported in the community all the time. And even in broad daylight, thieves can strike. The surprising thing was, was the time of day that it happened. At 10 o'clock in the morning. Pastor Frankie Taylor at Emanuel Baptist Church in Roebuck couldn't believe someone would drive away with the trailer sitting behind the church. Throw it on the back of his truck and just pull right straight out. Surveillance cameras captured these pictures. They posted them on Facebook for folks to keep an eye out. We had over 6,000 views that was looked on on Facebook. It, the word got out. It's a pretty common thing we hear about. At b &A Trailers, they make all kinds. Benjamin McElrath has this advice to try and keep thieves away. If a thief can't see something, they obviously are not going to be quite as tempted to steal it. He recommends putting the trailer in a building or behind a fence. If you can, remove the coupler or buy a lock. Any type of lock you can put on it. Obviously, locks can be disabled, but it's another thing to slow somebody down and make it uh, much less tempting to take a trailer. Pastor Taylor says the trailer at his church did have a padlock. We pray for that person. Uh, pray that uh, some way he'll find the Lord and he might bring the trailer back. Of course, it's probably a long time gone, but um, we just pray for him and hope the Lord he'll supply us another one. Another good idea is to make sure you have a serial number and a title that goes along with your trailer. You can also take pictures of it. Anything you can do to make sure you know that that trailer is yours and you can prove it. Reporting in Spartanburg County, Laura Thomas, 7 News.